Do you ever have a really dark day? What do you do? You get some bad news about yourself or your family or someone you love very much and you don't know what to do. Sometimes you can't pick up the phone and share it with a friend because it's too private or too difficult. Do you ever wonder what it's like to have someone praying for you? Some of you say yes. You go to church. You know about Jesus being our heavenly intercessor, the one who prays for us. But maybe most of you out there have never heard of that, that Jesus, who was crucified, rose from the dead, lives in heaven, ever lives to intercede for us or to pray for us. Have you ever heard that? That's in the Bible, actually written in the Bible. What a comfort it is to the Christian, what a comfort it's been to me in my dark days to know I believe what I read in the Bible is true, that Jesus Christ, risen from the dead, actually prays for me. And of course, he knows when my dark days come. He ever lives to intercede and pray for me. I hope that comforts you. Do you know Jesus? Is he living in your heart? He's also in heaven. He can do that. He's God. He's everywhere. And he's praying for you, especially in your dark days. Hebrews. That's a book in the Bible. Go to Hebrews 7, verse 25, and you'll see the verse for yourself. It was a dark day, and I was running on empty. And I didn't want to get up. Have you ever felt like that? I had to, of course. There was work to be done, people to see. And as I dressed, my spirits began to lift. They lifted and lifted and lifted. And I was alone in the house. And by now I was preparing breakfast. I had earlier thought I couldn't eat because of the knot in my stomach. I stood still in the kitchen, and by this time, my heart was tap dancing. Wonderingly, I asked myself, what's happening? And then with sudden understanding, I thought of all my friends who knew about my dark day and had promised to pray for me. Oh, I said out loud, that's what's happening. Somebody's praying for me. And then it came. <laughs> A voice so close. I am. I was immobile, savoring the moment. Of course, he ever lives to intercede for us. I opened the door of the day and went out. Lord Jesus Christ, thank you for being my heavenly intercessor. Thank you for ever living and praying for me. And when I'm running out of prayers, help me to share my dark days with my friends and remind me that you are the great I am, whoever lives to pray for me. Amen.